Afternoon, Daniel. How are you doing? Yeah, good afternoon. I'm okay, thank you. How are you? Yeah, I'm very well, thank you. How have you been getting on during all this and, and making sure that you're at home and you're, you're distancing from other people? Um, well, I would say it's been a bit tough because obviously we're just constantly in the household. But I think I'm trying to be as productive as possible, can I say? So, like every day doing my little bits, my workouts, and just really been spending time a lot with my family. So you're at home with family now then, are you? Yeah. Yeah, I am. Has that been okay? Um, yeah. You know, there's only so much you can see <laughs> someone before they get annoying, but now it's good to be with my family because while, while, whilst the season's on, we don't really get much time to spend that much time with your family, so it's, I think it's been nice. It's a good for a little break. How difficult has it been to, to keep on top with your, your fitness routines? Because obviously normally you'd be doing it at training, wouldn't you? And, and then you'd be doing little bits at home here and there. But now everything is solely up to you, isn't it? Whether you do it or not. Yeah. I think it's been a bit up and down. Like some days are easier than the other. But from like the staff at SSC, we've been sending enough program for us to follow. So I've literally been combining that with my own stuff each day. And it's just really been getting me up by, really. If it wasn't for that, I don't know what I'd be doing. I'd be lost in the house. You're doing a few key PFPs here and there as well throughout the house. Yeah, sure. I'll be mixing it up so just to make it so it doesn't become boring. I've always been switching up each day, but it's been good. Have you been in regular contact with your teammates as well? Do you know how they're getting on? Um, yeah, I've been, well, I've been in contact with mostly Josh and Admiral just on like the FaceTime and calls. And then we've been frequently messaging in our team group chats and just staying in touch, really, knowing what everyone's doing. Playing FIFA against them as well? Yeah. Well, FIFA, maybe. I've been playing against my little brother. He gives me the run around. He's good at FIFA, to be fair. But each day, yeah, playing FIFA, playing Call of Duty. Just really just doing stuff to make up my time. And watching television, I'm sure, and, and plenty of films as well as people are doing. We've been asking the players... What they've been watching, what would you recommend that the Blue Army can uh, have a look at watching? Um, well, at the moment, like, I guess everyone watches Netflix, but I'd say on Netflix to watch what's trending at the moment. Money Heist, that's a big thing at the moment. I've been watching that. Well, I've finished that. And I would recommend another series called The Lean, which is good. And there's one more I'm watching at the moment. Um... Oh, what's it called? Oh, I'm going blank. There's That's one more right. I'm watching. I'll get it. I'll get it to you. You'll get There's it by the by the end of this call. You'll you'll have remembered it. I think a, a yeah, lot of the players have been watching that money heist, so it, it, it seems like yeah, it's, it's, it's a good one. Really good. So I think a lot of people will be starting that one as a result of that. Um, obviously, this whole situation means that you're not, as we've said, at, at training every day. You're not playing football every day. You're not playing games every week, which must be a, a huge thing that professional footballers like yourself miss. Yeah. As again, I'll say it's been tough because I'm super used to training on a week basis, ready for your Saturday or Monday game. So at the moment, I'm doing everything with no, you know, no date and not knowing what's going to happen. Really, it's, yeah, it's been very frustrating, but it's just about keeping positive, really, and using it to your own advantage. Like I said to you, just. I can use it now to uh, really develop my game or, you know, just that rest and just, you know, recharge and wait, ready to go again or just spend time with my loved ones. I guess the, the time gives you, uh, the free time gives you a lot of time to reflect back on, on the season that you've had so far, both personally mm -hmm. and as a group. How, how would you rate it? Um, as a team, I think we've done very well this season. We've had, obviously, we've had our ups and downs when we've been losing games and not performing good, but... As a whole, I think from uh, the training sessions, from the team morale, from how the boys have been connecting with the manager, I think we've had a good year. And at the moment, we was just before everything pulled, we were second. So I think we were second, just a couple of points behind Chelsea. So therefore, I think we've been good. And on a personal level, yeah, I think my season's been all right. To be fair, I've performed quite well in all the games I've played, and I'm really, I was really enjoying it. 
Yeah, you went on a, a terrific run as a group, didn't you, of, of winning games consecutively in all competitions as well, this was. It was in the, yeah. the leasing.com trophy and then obviously in PL2 and in other cup competitions as well. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think our cup games were good. Like the leasing cup, I think we did really well in that. The boys performed well and needed to, be fair. The games were very tough. Um, the boys were getting them the results. We're just unlucky with the last game against New... Was it Newport? Newport. Yes. Yeah, we was unlucky with that. I think if, if we had to rub with the game on another day, we win and we go through, but sadly we didn't. But on performance level, I think everyone's been performing very good. And he, and he, like you said, in the league, we've been consistent as well. So, yeah, I'm happy with everything so far. Did you enjoy the, the, the leasing.com trophy then? Is it nice to test yourself against those sorts of teams and those sorts of players? Yeah, I think as some of the senior players in the club, I think they're the games where everyone likes to see what we're made of really see when we're competing against you know see the first team play and see how good we are but personally myself yeah I really enjoy them games we're very up for them games perfect well thank you very much for your time Darnell uh, before we do go have you got any little messages for the, the Leicester fans that are watching and in particular obviously the importance of, of those staying at home and, and saving lives um, yeah one important message really is just to I know it's frustrating and it's hard being at home 24-7, but just to stick to the guidelines, stay at home, stay safe. Um, if everyone follows the guidelines and everyone proceeds doing the right stuff, then this will be over sooner. So just just listen really and stay safe and enjoy your time spending with your loved ones.